Did uh, did you guys see the corny ass shit Drake did yesterday? Drake versus Fantano, bro. Did you guys see that? Where do, where do I even begin with this, man? It is so mind blowing. <laughs> it's like you're you're fucking Drake, dude. You have a net worth of over two hundred and fifty million dollars. You've got like over a hundred million followers on Instagram. You're obviously legendary in terms of the, the status that, you, that you've achieved, the success that you've attained. Why does anything matter to you at all? You won at life. So how does Fantano making a shit post about you sending him a vegan cookie recipe even show up on your radar? That in itself is crazy. And then why do you take the time out of your day to respond. You know what I mean? Like Fantano has what, 2 million subs? He's got a 50th of the following that Drake has. A 50th. He's one dude. He's one dude who has liked a couple of your albums and he has disliked a couple of other ones. Why does that matter to you, you know? Why does that matter to you? Why do you care about that? Why are you so salty and petty about it? Bro, you have enough money to disappear off the face of the earth retire, never work again, a day in your life, and you're young. You could die of old age at 115 years old, for all we know. You could live until then, lavishly, never have to worry about a goddamn cent, never have to work again a day in your life. You have an airplane, and you're DMing Fantano because he was trolling? You know? That's corny. And then he thought he really did something. He screenshots his own DMs and leaks his own DMs onto his Instagram stories. It wasn't Fantano who leaked it and said, oh my God, Drake just DM'd me and he came at me and said, my existence is a light one. Drake did it himself. And in the screenshot he posted, he basically leaked that he kind of came for Fantano and Fantano left him on red. How do you possibly think that you're doing something? How do you possibly think that leaking that DM is going to like give you a leg up on Fantano, who by the way, you shouldn't even fucking care about. It's corny, it's petty, it's childish. It's like, it makes no sense. It's like, I said this yesterday in the Discord server, it's like Drake forgets who, he, who the fuck he is sometimes. He does the weirdest shit, man. Like I said, he has an airplane. Twitter beef with Fantano, who's like, like I said, about a 50th of his following. That would be like, I have less than 20K subs. That would be like if I made a video that I thought was funny saying that Fantano was an egghead and it shows up on his radar, which already would be crazy. And then he DMs me about it. You know, it's like absurd. He's got like 2 million subs. What I say doesn't matter to him. So why does what he says matter to Drake? Hey, look, if I'm Drake, catch me never giving a single fuck about anything ever again in my life. If I'm Drake, nothing matters. I would do whatever I want, make whatever music I want, spend my money however I want, go out with whoever I want, fly wherever I want to on my fucking private airplane, and no one else matters, except my son. Hey. <laughs> You're a global superstar. <laughs> Fantano's a YouTuber, music reviewer. Hey, he's a nobody compared to you. Makes no sense. And the fact that it's this, like, Fantano said, he made a funny ass video about Drake DMing him a vegan cookie recipe at midnight, which I thought was hilarious. And that's the shit that gets Drake to come out of hiding and say something? That's the shit that Drake is like, puffing his chest out to reply to, among all the other shit that people say Drake does, among all the other shit people accuse Drake of doing, the vegan cookie recipe is what he replies to. Cause now we know if that shows up on his radar, all the other shit does too. When it comes to the really serious shit that he, he maybe should say something about, he acts like it's not worth his time. But the vegan cookie recipe, troll, that's worth your time? And not only that, but not only is it corny for you to even give Fantano the time of day, but then to DM him some petty shit 
that implies that you understand how his rating system works, by the way, which means you, you think about how he rates his albums and your albums, which means, you know, he, he lives in your mind somewhere. Not only that, but you revealed that he, he left you on red, which legendary, Fantano's a legend for that, by the way. Not only that, but then you get Fantano trending for hours on Twitter and the genius that he is, he takes that to his advantage and promotes his Pusha T album review and his video about honestly never mind not being good and to post funny memes at your expense and walk away with a massive fucking W. You handed him a giant W on a silver platter by even acknowledging his existence. Drake, corny bro, corny, corny. I fully expect three Drake DMs by tonight, man. I will capitalize on that shit, try me. Try me, that's an easy, you know, another 10,000 subs. What a salty little bitch move to, to leak that DM on your own Instagram story where you're taking a huge L and think that you're doing something. Makes no sense. Huge fucking L for Drake there, man. It's, it's a huge bitch move. Fantano walked away with a massive fucking W. A W is as thick as his thighs, bro. I was so happy to see it, man. Shout out to Fantano for that, man. That was, that was hilarious. That was hilarious.